Hello, my name is Eddie Biebergall, a solution architect with Cognigy, and today I'm going to show you how to use language recognition with the Audio Codes Voice Gateway. So, first things first, we have our session parameters node here, and here in advanced we have the uh, settings from Audio Codes used to activate the language detection. If we go over here into our lookup node, we also see that we have set it up to recognize the language detected uh, based on the data we receive back from audio codes. And we have a different path we're going on depending on the language detected. As default, we have English, because we're going to be assuming if one of the languages we're supporting isn't uh, recognized that the default language is going to be English. And after every single one of these flows, we actually have another set session parameters node to reset the language detection because after the language detection has been activated once, it will then not work anymore in order to prevent the user from accidentally changing the language again. So I'm just going to call this up and show you how that works. Good afternoon. Before we begin, please say a long sentence in your language. Okay, gladly, no problem. Hello, I am Keith, your virtual voice assistant. Sprechen Sie Deutsch? Ich bin Katrin, dein virtual assistant. Wie kann ich Ihnen helfen? Ich habe keine Probleme, aber danke. Sie sagten, ich habe keine Probleme, aber danke. Parlez français? Je suis Christine, votre assistante virtuelle. Comment puis-je vous aider? Nihongo dekimasu ka? Watashi wa virtual assistant no Kenichi desu. Honjit wa no yona go yoken de shou ka? So, as you can see, it was super simple to set up. And as you can also see, there's a, little, there's a little delay after the language recognition. That's normal because that has to actually work to do the actual recognition part. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact us at any time.